Today is the day when Austinites show just how generous they are by giving to more than 700 organizations from food banks to education and, of course, the arts. The reason the day is such an important day is because there's all of these added fun matches that quote amplify the day so your gift goes further on this day you can choose a cause through the amplify austin website or donate to all of them through the i live here i give here fund last year alone amplify raised 13 million dollars for local causes bringing the total to 93 million now in its 10th year the hope is to top 100 million when everyone participates you can have tremendous impact. One of the beneficiaries of Amplify is the Cold Town Theater here in East Austin, which brings sketch, comedy, and improv to the local community. If it's comedic, if it's local, it finds its way on the stage. Founded in 2006, Cold Town had to leave its longtime home on Airport Boulevard due to financial issues during the pandemic. This past October, they finally found a new space on East 2nd, but the building is set to be demolished this fall to make way for condos. There are bunk beds for if you're like codependent. <laughs> Their popular improv show called Strange Town parodies that plight. Strange Town is a great way to kind of showcase community coming together under one cause. Co-owner Dave Buckman is hoping people in real life will do just that. Donations will not only help them find a new home, but also pay performers and fund scholarships for improv classes like these. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one. Helping to promote diversity in the comedy world. We really try to open our doors uh, to as many different um, communities as possible to get their voices on stage and heard. Why are you yelling? Voices like Danny Gonzalez, who now teaches this class. Just being part of this community, everyone is very kind, everyone is very welcoming, and everyone just wants you to know how good you are, and no one brings each other down. And then, like, as an individual, it's made me more just comfortable in my own skin. Buckman even let me try my hands. We're going to do a word-at-a-time story. At a very basic form of improv. Once upon a time there was a person who lived in Austin, Texas, <laughs> and they ate it all up. Nice. <laughs>